What's up YouTube? It's me, Drummerboy0109, and today guys, I am here with another Minecraft Pocket Edition Redstone tutorial. This redstone tutorial is going to be a semi-automatic TNT cannon, and the benefits of this one is that it's a compact TNT cannon. Now, to make this, you're going to need a few different items. You're going to need a couple of dispensers, you're going to need redstone, you're going to need redstone torch, button, you're going to need slabs, and water. Uh, besides that, you're also going to need a ton of TNT, but that all depends on how much you guys want to use. This TNT cannon can range anywhere from 30 to 40 blocks. Uh, most times it can reach 40. It just depends on how the TNT reacts when it is exploded. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this TNT cannon, and then I'm going to show you guys uh, how to make it. So just press the button, and then it releases the TNT. It will shoot it out, and uh, you can see that it got rid of that... Uh, red dot that was at the top it actually red block at 46 blocks away so yeah let me go ahead and show you guys how to create this thing all right so we're gonna go ahead and start out with a three by three um three by three layout right here now over here i did make it more than three by three but all you need to do is just make it three by three then you want to take your dispenser put one here have another one face towards it and then have a dispenser going uh facing like this way and then what you're going to do next is you're going to place redstone on top of this back dispenser so redstone torch i mean i apologize then you go ahead and take a dispenser and place it like this so it goes like that. So there you go. Then what you need to do is you need to take a bucket. Now we're going to go ahead and build this up a little bit. And then place a slab so that it stops the water from flowing. Next thing you need to do is you need to take redstone. Place one redstone here, one redstone here. And then come to the back, crouch, take a button, and then place the button right here. Uh, next thing you need to do is this isn't required, but I do recommend it so that you can keep the TNT in a stable area. Is to just build this up to like this. So it's kind of just has like this cannon type look. After that, you're pretty much set, and all you have to do is just fill up these dispensers with TNT. So we're going to go ahead and fill these dispensers up with a couple of TNT, maybe like five or six. Uh, it can be how many you want, but then all you have to do after that is press the button. It will ignite the TNT, and it will shoot it off like this pretty far. So that one probably only went 30 blocks, but if you press it again, hopefully the following time you will get around 40, 46 blocks. So you can see the entity will be shot out and bang it will explode all the way over there now if you do not want the tnt to be shot in the air you could possibly just lower it into the ground uh, that it just depends on how you want to do it but this tnt is basically made for uh, bases that are raised up in the air around 10 or so blocks so yeah that's pretty much all i have for this video guys if you did enjoy make sure you do drop a like and leave some support share this video thank you guys for all the support you're giving me and i'm almost at 6,000 youtube subscribers so yeah that's pretty much it see you guys and gals and stay cool bye